Hope? Well, I don't know. I think hope is a funny thing. Emily Dickinson once wrote, Hope is the thing with feathers that perches in the soul and sings the tune without the words and never stops at all. In life, we are faced with challenges daily. These challenges prevent us with a choice. The way I see it, you have two options. You can give up or you can keep fighting. Someone once said, that which does not kill you only makes you stronger. I believe that's true. For this project, I read Nectar and a Sea by Kamala Markandaya. It is set in India in the late 1800s, early 1900s. When the book first begins, it is about a young woman who is forced into an arranged marriage to a man who is from a much lower social class. This begins the first of many obstacles that the main character, Rukmani, is forced to face head on. Throughout the book, she never gives up on hope, no matter what the challenge. Rukmani sees one of her sons die from starvation, her daughter forced into prostitution the vain hope of saving him. She sees the rest of her sons abandon her and her husband in the field. But, no matter what happens, whether it was her land being sold by the very people who owned it, and her being forced to leave her home over 30 years, to also seeing her husband die in her arms in a strange city, Rukmani never gives up on life and realizes that, no matter what, it's important to keep hope. That is something we could all stand to learn. That no matter how difficult things get, no matter what life gives you, it'll get better. Just don't give up. Keep fighting and look forward to the future.